What's up YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello and welcome. And if you're not, thank you for coming back. I'm Becca and here on my channel, I cover all things fitness and fashion and give you my honest review. For today's video, I have a Lululemon haul. A lot of items are very spring and summer inspired. I uploaded a Lululemon shorts video. It was probably a couple uploads ago and I talked about how it's very important to purchase shorts now before they are always sold out going into the spring and summer. So I have been purchasing a lot of different shorts because I'm trying to stock up before they go out of stock. So I have a lot of shorts, I have a lot of scubas, and some other new arrivals including the scuba shorts and the Align jumpsuit. So we're just gonna get straight into the review. Before I get started, don't forget to like and subscribe if you like this video and if you like my channel. And as always, I did link everything that I'm talking about in the description below so you can click on it and it'll take you directly to the website. All right, let's get into the haul because I have a lot of really great pieces. Okay, so we're gonna start off with the shorts that I have and I'm going to start with the very first short that I actually just received in the mail and this is a short that I never gave the time of day to just because I thought I wasn't going to like them but as soon as I put them on I immediately went to the website and I looked at what other colors they had available and added them to my cart because I feel like this is going to be my new go-to summer short. These are called the Track That Mid-Rise Short and these are five inches. I purchased these in a size six. Typically with Lululemon shorts, I always size up one size depending on the short, but most of the time I size up one size. So I recommend sizing up one size, especially if you would like more room around the leg opening. The reason why I never wanted to purchase these is because it said five inches inches and for me I usually like four inches like the hottie hot high rise or the low rise that's my preferred length and I didn't think I was going to like the five because I thought they were going to be a little bit too long but they're not they are perfect as far as the details go these are a mid-rise short and I would say they're pretty true to being a mid-rise fit I personally plan to wear these either playing some type of sport running walking to wear casually I really like these shorts because I feel like the leg opening is just a little bit wider than my other shorts. It is a really lightweight swift fabric. I purchased them in white because I've been really trying to look for a really good white short and I'm very happy with the white shorts. They do have these available in like five or six colors and that's probably one of my biggest complaints. I wish they had these shorts in other colors like in the hottie hots and the speed ups and hopefully they will do that. But I really like the fabric. They're extremely lightweight. They have a lot of really good stretch to them. They do have a built-in liner and the built-in liner is tan. The liner is very comfortable. I have another pair of white shorts. I can't remember what they are called, but the liner is super tight and I had to cut the liner on both sides to make it a little bit looser, but this one doesn't feel uncomfortable at all and I think it's perfect. It does have a little side pocket that zips so you can store a key in there. It has a draw cord where you can customize the fit and I'm just very happy with the quality and the fit of these shorts. I am super impressed. I can't believe I am just now trying these because honestly, I think these may be one of my new favorite shorts from Lululemon. Okay, moving on to the next short. These are the Hottie Hot High Rise Short. These are four inches. They do offer these shorts in two and a half if you like a shorter short, but I like the four inches. And I purchased them in a size eight and they were $68. And I purchased these in Sonic Pink. I am really into pink right now. It is my current color phase, as you can see with this scuba. And I just absolutely love this color. One thing that I I really like about the hottie hots is they offer a lot of different colors versus like the track that shorts that I'm wearing right now or some of the other ones. I actually had these in my cart for a really long time and I had them in a size six because in the hottie hot high rise I size up one size to a six and in the low rise I size up to a size eight and I had the size sixes in my cart for a while and then I went to my cart and they were sold out and I was like okay I just have to get them I have to get them in a size eight and hopefully they will work. They fit, but honestly, I would prefer a size six. The fabric of these shorts are very similar to the white ones. Although I will say every time I purchase a white Lululemon short, the fabric always feels a little bit stiffer than my other shorts. And I'm not sure why, maybe it's because of the color. It's not uncomfortable. It just feels a little bit different, but this fabric is really lightweight. It's very stretchy. It has a lot of stretch to it. So they're very comfortable. These shorts, I feel like have more extra leg room in them as well, which I really like, especially when you're walking 
walking, when you're running, playing a sport in them, anything like that. Now these are a high rise fit. They are definitely higher than the shorts that I just showed you, but I wouldn't consider them my highest rise Lululemon short. I have some Lululemon shorts that are called high rise as well and they are a lot higher, like the Find Your Pace high rise short. They do have a built-in liner. It is the same color as the short. They have a draw cord where you can customize the fit and I would definitely need this for these shorts. They have a little pocket right here where you can put a key or something like that. And honestly, I don't feel like I ever noticed this little pocket in my other hottie hot shorts. I'm going to have to go back and see if my other ones have that or maybe it's a new feature. Um, but anyway, they also have a little zipper right here where you can store a key or something like that. These shorts and the other ones that I just showed you are very versatile. I would run in both. So if you're looking for a really good running short, I would recommend either one of these. But I would also wear these casually and to run errands. So I feel like these two shorts are extremely versatile and I would highly recommend them because they are really nice quality and I just love the fit. Okay, moving on to the next short. I mentioned earlier that I have been looking for a really good white short and I actually purchased these before I purchased the very first ones that I just showed you. And these are called the Tracker Low Rise Short 4 inches and I purchased them in a size 6. And the reason I purchased these is because I have a black pair and I really like my black pair. But with these, I feel like I need a size eight because they are a little bit snug around the leg. So with the black ones, I wear a size six and they fit perfectly. But with these white ones, I feel like I need a size eight. As far as sizing goes, I guess it depends on what color you get. I don't know. Um, but I would first try just going up one size. These shorts are definitely a low rise short. They're definitely lower than the very first ones that I showed you. And that's fine with me because with these shorts, I wear like the all yours tee or a longer t-shirt or something like that with them. I don't plan on wearing a crop top. They are the same material as the first two shorts, the lightweight swift fabric. And actually this tag says that they are designed with athletic quads in mind. And that's interesting because I feel like they're a little bit tight around the quads compared to the hottie hots and the track that mid rise short. And maybe I just need to go up one more size to prevent that from being tight around there. The waistband has the draw cord right here where you can customize the fit and it has a tan built in liner. They also have a little pocket right here, which I feel like all Lululemon shorts have that. And I really like that feature a lot because I definitely use it, especially if I'm running in the shorts and I'm really happy with the length. I really like the four inch shorts and I like the five evidently as well. Um, so yeah, I really like these shorts. I just feel like I need to go up one size and they would be the perfect fit. Moving on to the next short, I stalked the Lululemon website forever to get my hands on these shorts in this color and they finally went in stock. And you know how when you add something in your cart, it says there's three left in stock or something like that. That's what it said in my cart and I immediately purchased them. But anyway, these are called the Align Bike Short. These are six inches and I purchased them in Blue Nile. I'm obsessed with this color as well. Blue Nile and Pink Blossom and Sonic Pink are just like my favorite colors right now. I have something else in Blue Nile, which you probably see behind me, but I absolutely love this color. As far as sizing goes, I purchased all of my Align Bike Shorts in a size four and they are the perfect fit for me. Sometimes I have to size up in a bike short so they're not tight around my leg, but this is not the case for these shorts. So I would recommend just sticking with your true size. If you have a pair of aligned leggings, I would probably just go with that size. Another really great thing about these shorts is they offer these in several different lengths. So if six inches is not your cup of tea, they also have eight and 10 available. And they also have a shorter one that's four. I think I have like one pair that's four and I never really wear them, but I do have several sixes and I wear them all the time, especially in the summer. The fit is very similar to the aligned legging and the material is the exact same, the Nulu fabric, which is brushed on the outside and brushed on the inside. So this is what the front looks like. It has the front seam. These are extremely complimenting. I very rarely wear these with like a crop top or like a sports bra or something like that. I always wear these shorts with an oversized tee. It's kind of like my go-to look in the summer. And this is what the back looks like. Like I said, they're very complimenting. I really like the length a lot. I feel like they're very appropriate. They're very comfortable. They're very complimenting and they are the perfect length for me. So I had to get them in this color and I'm super excited I was able to grab them in this color. If you are on the hunt for a really good bike short, I would highly recommend these. And okay, moving on to, I believe, 
Yes, the last short that I have. These are called the Scuba High Rise Short. These are five inches and I purchased these in a size four and just in the color black. These are newer to Lululemon. They had just released them probably a couple weeks ago in black and denim blue, I believe, and I just picked them up in black. I was super excited to give these a try. As far as sizing goes, I purchased them in a size four, but honestly, I feel like I would like them better in a size six because the leg opening is pretty snug around my leg, and I just prefer my shorts to not be snug around my legs. So I feel like if I go up one size, they would be a lot better. So I would recommend sizing up one size in these. These are a really nice high rise fit. They obviously remind me of the scuba jogger. I feel like the waistband is definitely not as tight as the scuba jogger because that's probably one of my biggest complaints with the scuba jogger is it is pretty snug around your waist, but I feel like this one is not. So this is what the front looks like. It has the draw cords right here, obviously where you can customize the fit. It has two really deep pockets where you can fit a phone in there. And it also has a little like pocket mesh pocket on the inside. The back just looks like this. Again, very similar to the scuba jogger. So as far as the fabric content, these shorts feel almost identical to the scuba jogger. They are a blended cotton fleece fabric. They are fleece on the inside and they're really soft on the outside. They are a thicker short. Like I said, they're almost just like the joggers, but just in short form. The one thing I will say about these shorts is these will be very warm on a hot summer day. So I personally would not choose these for a really hot day because I feel like they would be very hot in the summertime. Another thing I will say is I'm not super crazy about the five inch length. I feel like it's an awkward length and it worked with the Track That Mid-Rise short because it has a larger leg opening, but with these, they're pretty snug around my leg and I feel like it doesn't complement my legs in any way. So for that reason, I'm not super crazy about the fit of these shorts. And that may be a very unpopular opinion. I just feel like these need to be more relaxed looking. And it says on the tag, they're supposed to be a relaxed fit, but they do not look like a relaxed fit on me. And maybe I just need to size up and they will. But I don't think I'm going to keep these because of the length. I don't feel like they look super relaxed. And I just feel like they don't look super complimentary on. I don't know. That's my opinion. I will say that the quality is really nice and if you really like the scuba jogger and if you like a short that is longer, you may like these. Um, I'm just not a huge fan of them. Okay, moving on to the next item. This is another item that I literally just got in the mail, but I live in these in the spring and summer and they just came out with this pattern and I just loved it so I had to pick it up. This is called the All Yours Tea and this is tie-dye. I am a sucker for tie-dye and I purchased this in a size six. I usually size up one size in these t-shirts just because I prefer more of an oversized fit. I have a couple that are a size four that I wear with like my hottie hots or speed ups, but I like to purchase a size six with my bike shorts and that's what I intend to wear with this top. Okay, so let's talk about this color because I'm obsessed with this color and I know that tie-dye is not for everyone. Some people love it, some people hate it. I still love it and I actually did not plan on pairing this top with the blue Nile biker shorts, but I think that they would go perfectly together. I even think this top would go really well with the white aligned bike shorts or just like any white short. So this top is designed to be relaxed fit and hip length. And I think since I sized up one size, it's a little bit longer than hip length, which I'm fine with. It's in a very soft cotton material. I absolutely love this material. It's so soft. It's so comfortable and there's not a lot to it. I just really like the fit. It. And like I mentioned earlier, I live in these in the summer and I just had to have this color. Quality is also extremely nice. I have several and I have washed and dried them all and they have all held up really nicely. So they will definitely last you a long time. Okay, moving on to the next couple items. These are all scubas and they're just all different variations in different colors. And then after the scubas, I will talk about the aligned jumpsuit, which is maybe the only reason you came for this review and that's perfectly fine. But anyway, starting with the scubas, the first one that I'm wearing right here is 
pink blossom in the full zip and this is in a medium large. I have a couple extra small smalls in other scubas and I have found that I prefer the medium and large because after you wash the scubas, they do shrink just slightly in the sleeves and the overall fit. So if I purchase a medium large and then I wash it and then I dry it, it fits me just like an extra small, small wood. So I would recommend going up one size in these scubas. I really like the scubas. They're very soft on the outside. They have a fleece lining on the inside. I have several different variations of the scubas and I wear them all the time. I really like the full zip and you can pair an aligned tank or something like that underneath of it. Overall, I absolutely love this scuba full zip. They are definitely worth the price. I definitely get my wear out of them and they are really nice quality. This pink blossom one sold out so quickly. So what I would recommend is adding the full zip zip to your wish list and then constantly checking it in the morning, the afternoon, on Tuesdays when they do new arrivals to see if the pink blossom will go back in stock because I bet it will since it sold out so quickly. Next scuba that I have is the funnel neck in blue Nile and yes I'm definitely going to pair this with the aligned bike shorts. The whole blue Nile fit I have to but I also feel like this would go really well with like a pair of white aligned bike shorts that I haven't been able to purchase yet because are always sold out or maybe just the track that mid-rise short that's white um but anyway i think the funnel neck is probably my favorite scuba i like them all but i think i wear the funnel neck the most and this is what the front looks like. It has very similar features to the full zip, except it obviously doesn't have the full zip. And it has a kangaroo pocket instead of two separate pockets, but it does have the thumb holes right here and then the Lululemon logo is in the back. The quality, the material is the exact same as the full zip and my other scubas. And the last scuba that I have is the half zip with a hood and I purchased this one in a medium large and I don't think I mentioned what size I wore in the blue one. The blue one, the blue Nile is a medium large as well. Um, but anyway, this is in the color date brown and I purchased this on sale and honestly as soon as I purchased it I kind of regretted it because the color doesn't look that great online and and I was like, oh, I shouldn't have purchased that because now I'm not gonna be able to return it. I don't think I'm gonna like the color, but the color is completely different in person. It is way better. And honestly, I absolutely love this color so much. As far as the details go, the material is the exact same as the other scubas, a really soft material on the outside, a fleece material on the inside. It has a really nice big hood, just like the full zip. And then this is what the half zip looks like with the kangaroo pocket. And it also has has thumb holes. Overall, I absolutely love the scuba and it's even better when you were able to purchase it on sale and the quality, the fit, everything is absolutely great. Okay, moving on to the last item. It is the Align bodysuit. I believe I called it a jumpsuit earlier, but same thing, right? And this is 25 inches in length and I purchased it in a size four and in the color black. And they offered this in three different colors. And I believe the black last time I checked is sold out, but I would constantly check the website because I imagine that they will continue to restock this. And I I believe it was $148, which is pretty pricey, but you have to think of it as you're getting two for one. So you're getting a top and a pair of leggings. It's just all connected. So as far as sizing goes, I think it's going to be a little bit tricky. So for me, I just purchased my true size and it fits perfect. And I think that anyone that has an A or B cup size, I would stick with your true size. But since this top portion is intended for A and B cup sizes, I'm not sure how well a true to size bodysuit would fit someone with a C cup or higher. So I would almost say to size up one size if you have a C cup or higher. As far as the fabric content, if you're familiar with the Align legging, the Align tank, which I'm sure everyone is by now, it is in the Nulu fabric, which is the brush material on the outside and the inside. And the top portion feels almost identical to the Align tank. So if you really like the fit of the Align tank, then you will really like the top portion because it's it's almost identical. If the Align Tank is not your favorite, then you're probably not going to like the top portion of this bodysuit because like I said, it's almost identical. It has the little like V-neck like this. The straps are the same tightness. Like everything is almost identical. The back looks like this, a little scoop design. It does have a built-in sports bra and it has removable cup padding. It has the stitching down the middle to separate the cup padding. And as far as the legging portion, so you can kind of see what it looks like 
in the front it has the front seam and then the back looks like this with the little like straight across back seam. I will say that the legging portion feels a little bit thinner than your typical Align legging. And I don't know, maybe it's just me, but I feel like it feels just slightly thinner. It's not see-through at all, but it just feels a little bit different than your typical black Align legging. Not in a bad way, it just feels a little bit different. I really like the length. I personally like 25 inches in the Align pants, so I knew I was going to like the length. The overall bodysuit does not feel super compressive. It just feels very lightweight. It feels like you're wearing nothing. It's not uncomfortable in any way. I don't feel like it rides up in the front or the back at all. It stays in place really nicely. This is intended, I believe, for yoga, but I personally would wear this casually. And I'm going to be honest, I don't think I own one bodysuit like this and I never have just because I've never been like super interested in them. And I just honestly don't really know how I would style them. So I don't know how realistic this is for me personally, but if you're someone that really likes bodysuits like this and you wear them a lot and you get a lot of use out of them I would say this one is definitely a really good option because it is really nice quality I do like the overall fit it literally just feels like the Align top and the legging combined so obviously I like both of those things but personally for me I would probably just wear the Align tank and the Align legging and have that separation in the middle but like I said if you are into something like this then you would probably really like this I have seen a lot of people say that they like like this one over like the Aritzia one and there was another one I can't remember what the brand was but I've seen a lot of different reviews talking about how this one is definitely better. I personally don't have any of those, so I can't speak on those. I will say that this is a really nice option if you do like jumpsuits. And that includes everything in this Lululemon haul. I always like to mention the two items I would recommend purchasing first if you can only purchase two items. And I'm going to start with number one, the Track That Mid-Rise short. I am just blown away by them. I truly did not think I was going to like them, but I actually really love them, especially going to spring and summer. I feel like it's a really good staple short to have. Second item that I recommend is one of the scubas, depending on which one you like best with the hood, without the hood, um, or the full zip. I just get a lot of use out of mine. I really like the fit and they are really nice quality. Thanks again for joining me in this review. Please let me know if you have any questions in the comments below and we'll see you in the next haul.